So I just wanted to show you a little bit of flux mode here. Um, so currently flux is um, is off. Um, the way you can tell, you can just have a look here. Unfortunately, Tractor hasn't built in um, any on-screen instruction to show you or on-screen uh, feedback to say, hey, uh, flux mode's on. So there's nothing that tells you it's on or off until you actually press the loop button. Um, so I'm currently just using the X1. I've turned flux mode on in here, making sure um, the little dots next to it means it's on. Once it's on, I can select uh, a one, a one beat, half beat, quarter beat, whatever. And as we hold it, you'll see the green line approaches, keeps going forward. So as we loop, you'll see the green line moves forward, and that's where the track will restart from again. We can start on what, 30 second, and leave it this way, and then it'll pick back up from where it started. So to turn loop flux off again, we have to go in and click on here and turn it off. And then when we press the loop, we have a normal loop and then we take it off. It carries on from where the loop ends. So that's one way that you can use the flux. What I've also done um, is in the preferences, I've just gone into controller manager and uh, in the keyboard mapping, I've gone to flux mode on um, and I've assigned it to, to deck A. Um, you can assign it to uh, deck focus if you wanted to um, or you can assign a button for whatever one you want. So the way I did that, I went to add in deck common and then at the very bottom you've got flux mode on. Um, then I just assigned, um, assigned a button to it and on this particular one I just assigned shift plus the, uh, plus the number pad enter on the Mac here and that seems to turn it on and off. So if we're playing the deck, and uh, again, the only problem is there's no feedback on the screen. So shift enter, and then hold down the loop button. As you can see. And then if I just go, go ahead and shift enter again, and then you can see the flux mode's not on. Um, so again, if tractor's listening, I wouldn't mind like some sort of indication to say flux mode is on for those that don't want to uh, assign an LED on a controller.